guys, good to see you. Um, just with an eye to Harriers v Hereford twice over the Christmas period, no one better qualified to have an opinion on on that. These were always the types of games you enjoyed playing in, I guess. Oh, lovely. You know, even looking around this morning, it's wet, it's cold. Um, strikers paradise. You know, you, you expect mistakes from from both sides. Um, I think you know a local derby. Granted, we're not going to have the, 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 the sort of guidance and the help that the fans will bring, but I'm sure there's going to be some in attendance, probably not, you know, not what there what the should be, in, as both clubs would hope to be, but um, it should be a fascinating occasion. Both teams wanting to get one over on each other. Um, I'll be sort of watching on from, from afar, but you know, keenly yeah, looking at the result. I know we could probably talk about it for most of the day, but fair to say you enjoyed your time at both clubs? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Funny enough, a couple of the lads have just been asking about what I've, what I've been doing here, and obviously they know my spell at Hereford as well, so uh, thoroughly enjoyed both spells, to be honest, at both clubs, and um, you know, two, two clubs' results, so we'll look for quite keenly when the results fire in on a Saturday afternoon. And I guess from your point of view, and wanting both of these clubs to do well, pleased to see them both under the guidance of young, enthusiastic, kind of hungry managers. Yeah, I think you've hit the nail on the head. I think they are both uh, young managers. I think Josh and Russ have helped get qualified and put them through the coaching qualifications. And I think, you know, hopefully over a period of time, they'll start start to show what they can do and start to a with their respective clubs move them up the leagues. Uh, but b, you know, we want to keep football people in the game, people who've played the game, the knowledge and experience that they've got. You want to see them do well. So, uh, you know. I, I sincerely hope that they do and you know, to be honest both clubs should not be in this league should they, they should be a lot higher in the leagues above and I hope that's the case. You've gone on to have a great kind of uh, coaching and analytical career after your playing days, but guys of mine to be aware, what kind of fills your days just now and, and what brings you to the area today? Well, it, it's quite a lengthy sort of role I've got, isn't it? but um, basically what we're trying to do is help, e help increase the quality and quantity of English qualified coaches. So, um, and my role in, in specifically at the top end, so you know Premier League, um, Championship, those sort of young aspiring managers, uh, and particularly a group that are transitioning who are making that that step up from playing into coaching and management, perhaps a little bit like Russ and Josh, but, but much lower down the pyramid. So my role is to help them become better really and just observe, give them guidance, give them feedback and, and give them some content that's going to help them become more polished, I suppose. And nice, I guess, to see players that you'll kind of work with in various facets of your career, like you said, still in the game, if they're at the end of their playing days. I mean, we look at like of Lowy, who only ever seems to get younger, yeah. and Russ starting his managerial career, that must be pleasing for you. It is, well, you know, you look around the, the sort of the 92 league clubs, if you just looked at those, the amount of former players that are now coaches and managers, probably 95% of them are. And we want to keep that knowledge and experience in the game. So to see people make that step up and that transition, which is never easy, whatever role or job you go into or career. So to have these types of people in the game and you know, I can already see Russ is buzzing around this morning, he's enthusiastic, he's energised. The players I was in the other day, they're, they're sort of doing the same. And, the, the feedback off each other, so those are the types of people you want. So um, it's great, it's good for the for the future of the game, and long may it continue. Now you've just got to get the rub of the green and, the, and get the results to go with it.